Hello, and welcome to Russia Ukraine News, where we cover every latest on Russian invasion on Ukraine. Please make sure to subscribe and like the video. The massive fire dispatched plumes of black smoke billowing throughout a city at the outskirts of Moscow. Footage shared on social media on Friday indicates clouds of smoke growing from a constructing in Korolev that's called the cradle of Russian and Soviet area exploration. It has now no longer been viable to verify the date or time of the blaze. If confirmed, the fire will be the one-third pronounced to have struck tremendous places in Russia this week. It comes after a hearth place broke out at Russia's biggest chemical plant. Smoke became visible growing from the Dmitrivsky chemical plant close to the border with Ukraine on Thursday. The blaze follows a fire which reportedly killed six people in a Russian Ministry of Defense constructing with inside the city of Tver, northwest of Moscow. Russia's TASS information organization noted a supply as announcing on Friday that a criminal investigation into fire protection has been released after six people died and extra than 20 have been injured in a blaze on the Defense Studies Institute. TASS quoted a regulation enforcement supply as saying army investigators will inspect the case. It reported that the fire broke out on Thursday, killing six, injuring 24 and prompting evacuation of approximately 100 people. Interfax pronounced on Friday that an electrical fault triggered the blaze. Footage from the scene which regarded on Russian social media confirmed thick smoke and flames billowing from the institute's home windows. Still photos taken past due on Thursday confirmed the charred stays of a four-story constructing with blackened holes where in home windows as soon as have been. Regional government stated firefighters stopped the blaze, which blanketed 2,500 rectangular meters, from spreading to neighboring homes and homes. The institute is engaged in aerospace studies, which includes on a unified air defense system for the CIS bloc of former Soviet republics, consistent with the Russian Defense Ministry's website. Meanwhile, on Friday a Russian Weltman stated Moscow desires to take complete manipulate of southern Ukraine in an assertion Kiev stated gave the mislead the Kremlin's beyond pledge that it had no territorial ambitions. So guys, with that we have come to an end of this edition of the news. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time. Bye.